Have you ever wondered why certain activities seem so irresistible, even when you know they're not the best for you? You see, there's a little chemical in your brain called dopamine that plays a big role in this. It's like the puppet master behind the scenes, pulling the strings of your desires and actions. Dopamine is a neurotransmitter, a kind of messenger in your brain that plays a crucial part in how we feel pleasure. It's connected to our reward system, you see. When you do something enjoyable, your brain releases dopamine, making you want to repeat that action again and again. So whether it's that extra piece of cake you know you shouldn't have or the addictive pull of social media, it's dopamine driving those urges. But it's not all about indulgence and bad habits. Dopamine also motivates us to achieve our goals and seek out new experiences. Dive with me into the fascinating world of dopamine and how it shapes our lives. Dopamine, a simple molecule with profound effects on our brains. This tiny neurotransmitter, invisible to the naked eye, plays a monumental role in our daily lives. But what exactly is dopamine and how does it function in our brains? Well, let's start with the basics. Dopamine is a type of neurotransmitter, a chemical messenger that transmits signals in the brain and other areas of the body. It's produced in several areas of the brain, including the substantia nigra and the ventral tegmental area. Now you may be wondering, how does a molecule like dopamine influence our behavior? The answer lies in its role in the brain's reward system. When we engage in activities that are enjoyable or necessary for survival, such as eating a delicious meal or achieving a personal goal, our brain releases dopamine. This release creates a sensation of pleasure and reward, which motivates us to repeat these behaviors. But dopamine isn't just about pleasure and rewards. It also plays a critical role in movement, memory, and learning. It helps us focus on tasks, remember important details, and make decisions. It's a key player in our ability to think and plan. Here's where it gets interesting. The amount of dopamine in our brain isn't constant. It can fluctuate based on a variety of factors, including our activities, diet, sleep, and stress levels. When these factors are in balance, our dopamine levels are regulated, leading to a healthy state of motivation and satisfaction. However, when our dopamine levels are too high or too low, it can lead to problems. High levels can contribute to feelings of anxiety and restlessness, while low levels can result in lack of motivation and pleasure. This is why understanding and managing our dopamine levels can be crucial for our overall well-being. In essence, dopamine is the feel-good neurotransmitter. But its influence goes far beyond just making us feel good. It's a complex and fascinating molecule that plays a crucial role in our brain's function, shaping our behavior, motivation, and emotions. Dopamine doesn't just make us feel good, it shapes our habits and behaviors. Now let's delve into the fascinating world of dopamine and its profound influence on our habits. Picture this. You're scrolling through your social media feed, you come across a post that makes you laugh, you hit the like button, and boom! A surge of dopamine is released in your brain. This feel-good hormone rewards you for engaging with content that brings you joy, subtly nudging you to repeat the action. This is a simple example of how dopamine reinforces behaviors through what we call the reward system. When you do something that your brain perceives as beneficial, it rewards you with a shot of dopamine. This rush of pleasure makes you want to repeat the action. Over time, this repetition solidifies into a habit. But here's the kicker. The activities that trigger a dopamine release aren't always beneficial in the long run. Think about that piece of chocolate cake you know you shouldn't have, but just can't resist. Or the late night Netflix binge when you should be sleeping. These actions trigger an immediate dopamine high, which can make them habit forming, despite their negative impact on your health or productivity. The flip side, however, is that understanding how dopamine shapes our behaviors can empower us to form healthier habits. Regular exercise, for instance, releases dopamine, making you feel good and encouraging you to keep up the habit. Similarly, completing a task or achieving a goal can also trigger a dopamine release, reinforcing productive habits. It's important to note that dopamine doesn't distinguish between good or bad habits. Its job is to reinforce behaviors that it perceives as rewarding. It's up to us to consciously steer these behaviors in a direction that benefits us in the long run. So you see, Dopamine is like a double-edged sword. It can lead us down a path of unhealthy habits, or it can be harnessed to create positive change in our lives. Our habits, then, are not just a product of our conscious decisions, but also of our brain's chemical reactions. But what happens when our brain's reward system goes awry? 
Imagine a game where you're constantly rewarded not for achieving milestones or overcoming challenges, but simply for just playing. That's essentially what's happening in our brains when dopamine is overstimulated. It's like a never-ending party in your neurons and it feels fantastic at first. However, just as an endless party would eventually exhaust you, so too does this constant flood of dopamine. Over time, our brains start to adjust to this new normal and begin to crave more and more dopamine to achieve the same pleasurable feelings. This is where the dark side of dopamine comes into play. Overstimulation of the dopamine system can lead to a host of harmful behaviors. You see, dopamine doesn't differentiate between healthy rewards and harmful ones. It simply responds to stimuli that triggers its release. So when harmful behaviors such as excessive gambling, overeating, or substance abuse trigger dopamine release, the brain starts to associate these behaviors with pleasure and reward. Despite the immediate gratification these behaviors might provide, they can lead to long-term consequences such as addiction, health issues, and social problems. And this is where the concept of a dopamine detox comes into focus. A dopamine detox isn't about completely eliminating dopamine from your brain. That's impossible and undesirable, as dopamine plays a crucial role in our overall well-being and motivation. Instead, a dopamine detox is about resetting our brain's reward system. By consciously reducing the amount of dopamine triggers in our lives, we can help our brains recalibrate and break free from harmful behaviors. It's about learning to appreciate the smaller, healthier rewards in life and retraining our brains to associate pleasure with these instead. Remember, our brains are incredibly adaptable, and it's never too late to change our habits. Understanding dopamine's role in these behaviors is the first step towards managing them. Now that we've understood the power of dopamine, how can we use this knowledge to our advantage? Let's dive into this exciting topic. When it comes to dopamine, it's all about balance. Too little of it and we feel sluggish, unmotivated, too much, and we risk becoming overstimulated, chasing instant gratification over long-term satisfaction. So, how do we find this balance? One effective strategy is a dopamine detox. This is not about eliminating dopamine, as it's essential for our well-being and motivation. Instead, it's about resetting our brain's reward system. We do this by temporarily avoiding activities that cause dopamine spikes, like excessive use of social media, eating sugary foods, or binge-watching TV shows. This break allows our brains to recalibrate and helps us to appreciate the smaller, more sustainable sources of dopamine, like reading a good book or having a deep conversation with a friend. You might be wondering, but won't life be boring without my favorite activities? Quite the opposite. A dopamine detox can help us rediscover the joy in simple, meaningful activities that we've been overlooking in our chase for the next dopamine hit. Another method is to use our understanding of the brain's reward system to reinforce positive habits. Let's say you want to start exercising regularly. You could reward yourself with a small treat after each workout, like a favorite song or a short relaxation session. This creates a positive association in your brain, making it more likely that you'll stick with the habit. But remember, the key is moderation. The goal isn't to replace one dopamine spiking activity with another, but to foster a healthier relationship with our dopamine response. Remember, dopamine is not the enemy. It's a powerful tool that, when understood and managed correctly, can significantly improve our quality of life. By harnessing the power of dopamine, we can break free from unhelpful habits, cultivate more meaningful ones, and ultimately, lead a more fulfilling life. With a better understanding of dopamine, we can take control of our habits and lead more fulfilling lives, We've taken a deep dive into the world of dopamine today. We've uncovered the dopamine puzzle, piecing together how this chemical messenger impacts our everyday lives. We've journeyed through the fascinating science behind dopamine, enlightening us on its essential role in our brain's reward system. We've explored how dopamine influences our habits, shaping our behaviors and driving our motivations. We've also shed light on the dark side of dopamine, understanding its role in addiction and the challenges it presents. But most importantly, we've discovered how to harness the power of dopamine. We've learned that, with awareness and intention, we can manage dopamine to cultivate better habits and improve our overall health. This journey into the world of dopamine has shown us the profound impact this neurotransmitter has on our lives and how we can leverage this knowledge for our betterment. Remember, knowledge is power, and understanding dopamine gives us the power to shape our lives for the better.